In the words of Dolores Cannon, we are living in a hologram. It's time we recognize this illusion and see beyond the physical. Imagine, if you will, a world where numbers are not just digits, but keys to unlocking the mysteries of the universe. This is the world as seen by the likes of Dolores Cannon and Nikola Tesla, visionaries who dared to peer beyond the veil of reality and glimpse the underlying truth. Their teachings, steeped in a mix of science, spirituality, and a dash of the esoteric, propose a fascinating concept, that the numbers three, six, and nine hold a special significance. They suggest that these numbers, in their simplicity, conceal profound truths about the nature of our reality. As we dive into the depths of this mystery, remember Tesla's words. If you only knew the magnificence of the three, six, and nine, then you would have the key to the universe. Chapter 1. The Enigma of Tesla Nikola Tesla, a man of science, yet deeply fascinated by numerology. As we delve into the enigma that was Nikola Tesla, we find a figure who straddled the line between scientific rationality and a profound fascination with the mystical power of numbers. Born in the mid-19th century, Tesla was a visionary ahead of his time. His work in electrical engineering and physics revolutionized the way we understand and use energy, yet it was his peculiar belief in the significance of certain numbers that truly sets him apart. Tesla was particularly captivated by the numbers 3, 6, and 9. He famously declared, If you only knew the magnificence of the 3, 6, and 9, then you would have the key to the universe. But why these numbers? What was it about this numerical trio that so deeply entranced one of the greatest scientific minds of his era? Tesla's fascination with these numbers wasn't just a random obsession. He saw patterns everywhere, in the natural world, in the cosmos, and in the very fabric of reality. He believed that these patterns were not coincidental, but were, in fact, fundamental to the structure of the universe. In his work, Tesla often utilized these numbers. For instance, his groundbreaking design for the alternating current motor was based on a cycle of three, a principle that continues to underpin modern electrical systems. This was more than mere practicality for Tesla. It was a reflection of his belief in the sacred geometry of the universe. Beyond his scientific achievements, Tesla's numerical mysticism provides a glimpse into the mind of a man who was as much a poet and philosopher as he was a scientist and inventor. It reminds us that even in the realm of science, there is room for wonder, for mystery, and for the inexplicable. Tesla's belief in the power of three, six, and nine wasn't a quirky eccentricity. It was an integral part of his worldview, a cornerstone of his understanding of the universe and his place within it. He saw these numbers as keys, as codes to be cracked, as signposts pointing towards deeper truths about the nature of existence. Tesla believed these numbers held the key to understanding the universe. Chapter 2. Dolores Cannon's Teachings Now let's explore the teachings of Dolores Cannon, a woman who devoted her life to the metaphysical realm. Dolores Cannon was a pioneer of her time, an explorer of the unseen, the unheard, the unspoken. She was a woman who dared to cross the boundaries of the physical world and venture into the metaphysical, the spiritual, the esoteric. She was a woman who dared to cross the boundaries of the physical world and venture into the metaphysical, the spiritual, the esoteric. Her work, spanning over four decades, was dedicated to hypnotherapy, past life regression, and the exploration of consciousness and our place in the cosmos. Cannon believed in the limitless potential of the human mind. She taught that we are not just physical beings living in a physical world, but rather spiritual entities experiencing a human life. She saw the universe as a vast, interconnected web of energy where everything and everyone is linked at a fundamental level. Now, how does this relate to Nikola Tesla, you might ask? Well, much like Tesla, Cannon saw numbers not just as mathematical tools, 
but as keys to unlocking the mysteries of the universe. She believed that numbers held a deeper spiritual significance, reflecting the underlying patterns and rhythms of the cosmos. She saw the patterns of these numbers repeating throughout nature, throughout the cosmos, and even within our own consciousness. In her teachings, Cannon emphasized the importance of understanding the spiritual dimension of life. She taught that by looking beyond the physical world, by delving into the mysteries of the mind, the soul and the universe, we could gain a deeper understanding of ourselves and our place in the cosmos. Cannon, like Tesla, saw beyond the physical world. She understood the universe in a way many of us can only dream of. Chapter 3 the significance of three, six, and nine. Tesla once said, if you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. This brings us to the numbers three, six, and nine. Now let's delve into these intriguing numbers and their profound significance. In the realm of numerology, these numbers are not merely numerical values. They represent energy patterns, vibrations that resonate with the universe's fundamental principles. Three is the number of creation, the number of life. It signifies unity, the coming together of mind, body, and spirit. It also symbolizes the concept of growth, progression, and forward movement. In the world of vibrations, the number three resonates with an energy that inspires and stimulates creativity, imagination, and an open-minded approach to life. Moving on to six, it is the number of harmony and balance. It represents the need for stability and the search for equilibrium. It's about nurturing, caring, and responsibility. In terms of energy, six vibrates at a frequency that encourages empathy, love, and a strong sense of community. Finally, the number nine, the number of completion and fulfillment. It signifies the end of a cycle, the culmination of all the experiences and lessons learned. It's about wisdom, spiritual enlightenment, and inner strength. Its vibration resonates with a frequency that encourages self-reflection, introspection, and a deeper understanding of oneself and the universe. But why did Tesla place so much importance on these three numbers? What secrets do they hold? Well, Tesla believed that these numbers were key to understanding the universe's underlying structure. He saw a pattern, a rhythm, that these numbers followed. It's as if they were dancing to the same cosmic tune, vibrating at frequencies that harmonize with the universe's energy. He believed that these numbers, their energy, their frequency and vibration held the key to understanding the universe's secrets. Tesla also believed that these numbers represented a form of cosmic mathematics. He saw a pattern in the way these numbers interacted, the way they added, multiplied, and divided. He saw a symphony, a harmonious interaction that when understood, could unlock the universe's deepest mysteries. He even went as far as to say that if we understood the significance of these numbers, we would have unlocked the key to the universe. It's a profound statement, one that hints at a deeper understanding of the universe and our place within it. So what could be the true meaning of these numbers? How do they unlock the secrets of the universe? Chapter four, the key to the universe. In the end, what we learn from Tesla and Canon is that the universe is more than just physical matter. It's a symphony of numbers, a dance of digits, where every note and step has a purpose and a meaning. Tesla, the man who could see the invisible, and Canon, the woman who could understand the forgotten. Let's take a moment to see the similarities between Tesla and Dolores. Tesla, the master of lightning, saw the world in a way few could understand. He believed that everything we see, touch, and experience is interconnected through a complex web of energy. This energy, he proposed, could be understood through the language of numbers, and among these numbers, three, six, and nine held a special place. 
They were, in his view, the keys to unlocking the secrets of the universe. On the other hand, Dolores Cannon, a past-life regressionist and hypnotherapist, brought forth wisdom from dimensions beyond our own. She taught us about the power of the mind, the importance of understanding our past and the potential of our future. In her teachings, she too echoed the importance of numbers, particularly three, six, and nine. She saw them as vibrational frequencies, energies that resonate with the very fabric of the universe. It seems that in every area of life, bright-minded people arrive at the same conclusion. We humans are interconnected with the cosmos through our vibrational energy. Everything around us is vibrating, and together with our minds, we have the ability to bend reality. But understanding is just the beginning. The potential power of mind goes beyond mere comprehension. Mind could be the key to harnessing the universe's energy, to unlocking new technologies, to understanding our place in our own cosmos. Together, let's embark on this journey of discovery where the power of the mind may hold the key to unlocking the secrets of our cosmos and shaping our collective destiny. Thank you for watching, dear friends. Have a wonderful day.